East middle age. Not necessarily so. Imagine having one while you're still just a teenager. Well, that's what happened to one man from Staffordshire. He was left partially paralysed and unable to walk or talk. But far from it being the end, he became a sculptor. And as Ben Sidwell reports, he's just opened his first exhibition. When Steve Eastwood from Stafford had a stroke at the age of 19, it changed his life forever. Until then, he'd been following a career in engineering, but he was left paralysed down his right side, unable to walk or talk, and ready to give up on life. I felt like uh, committing suicide. I was going to kill myself, but I thought there's a God or somebody up there that has given me a second chance. It was during his time in rehabilitation that Steve was first introduced to pottery. He enjoyed it so much he went on to college before taking sculpting up as a career. It takes me longer to uh, do it as I haven't really got the uh, control of, of the uh, chisels. That means each one of his sculptures can take more than two years to finish. This year, Steve turned 40 and has just opened his first ever exhibition. Don't wish it on anyone to go through the uh, pain, anger, frustration that I've gone through. It's only uh, me having my uh, stroke that has made me uh, come up with the sculptures around me. If you want to see more of Steve's work, his exhibition is on at the Ancient High House in Stafford until the 31st of December. Ben Sidwell, BBC Midlands Today, Stafford. Isn't that a remarkable story? A stroke or not, mm. that's gorgeous stuff. Yeah, good luck with that exhibition, Steve. Shall we get back to the poolside now and join Nick Clitheroe with the sport? Nick? Yeah. Yes, thanks very much.